looking for cheap, fast, and reliable Madden Ultimate Coins, look no further than my sponsor, Mutt Reserve. Head over to MuttReserve.com. Use code Poodle at checkout for 30% off your order. Take advantage, guys. Do not waste your money on packs. Skip the packs. Head on over. Pick up some coins. Enjoy. Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video, guys. And today, I'm super excited. We have the Team of the Year reveal. Plenty of stuff to go over. Team of the Year reveal. Walkthrough for Tuesday, guys. Some updates. Um, you know, some stuff. Some recap. But otherwise... Team of the Year reveal is going to be super awesome, guys. I'm so excited to go over this all with you guys. Uh, team of the Year, one of the most fun promos all year. And like I said, I did miss it last year because I was in Spain at the time. So I was definitely upset. One of my favorite promos all year, and I did miss it. Now, remember, guys, if you have been playing your solos, you should be getting your free Team of the Year player starting tomorrow. And remember, they do usually introduce a second sequence, where if you do another set of solos, you get a second Team of the Year for all players. So if you miss the team of the week solos and don't get that one you can still get another one now the team of the week ones are typically auctionable and the ones you get from now are just not auctionable but again either way you get a team of the year player it's super awesome super exciting stuff definitely excited to go into that guys i'm gonna show you guys some players but before we do make sure you're down below like the video comment down below let me know what's going on guys can we get 100 likes on this banger video guys i'm so excited to go over it can we get 100 likes i would greatly appreciate that you guys have been showing so much support thanks to you guys being able to do a lot of stuff i've done in life i appreciate all the support you guys give me thank you so much comment down below smash the like button turn the naughty bubble boys and get hyped for team of the year first off comment down below before i show you every single one what was your prediction who was your big team of the year player that you wanted? And when I'm done with the video, comment down below who's your favorite of the bunch. Let me know. Is it a hometown guy? Is it a guy you like from the NFL? Is it just a guy you predicted? A guy for Madden purposes who will be meta? Let me know down below. I would love to see all of that, guys. But that's about it. If you guys need coins, pick up some team of the year players starting tomorrow at Tuesday. Head over to my reserve down below and use code Poodle for 30% off. But guys, it's about it for that. Let's go ahead over, over into some of the players. So we got Fred Warner, middle linebacker for the 49ers. A lot of people did predict him, guys. But the issue with Fred Warner, is, it's simple. 87 speed and his middle linebacker. He's not going to be a usable player. He does get 92 hit power, 92 zone, 88 block shot, which is really, really good. 96 play rec. But too way too slow for this point in the year. Way too slow. And he's not going to have the uh, the, the speed. He's not going to have the, the, the position, guys. Got to pass on him guys so first we have some pro bowl stuff after that one player we went over so we got some pro bowl stuff coming on so it's going to be similar to the herbert and garrett snowball fight pretty much what you're going to do is you're going to pick a side afc or nfc you get a player for which i'll go over and whichever side ends up winning they go up to a 95 overall so already we guys we got a free 94 to 95 overall now it's not like one of these where you could just pick up now it's earned points for afc or the nfc right so it's not gonna be based on a real life so again wait for youtubers to come out with it pick whichever one everyone goes you pretty much have a free 95 uh, play the Pro Bowl showed on House Rules. There's going to be a House Rules event you have to play in. So, again, not going to be solos. going to be House Rules. And the winner gets to 95 overall. And here it is. Pro Bowl Showdown. We got NFL Pro Bowl Showdown and Team of the Year, which is pretty exciting. So, the AFC player is going to be AJ Brown, 94 overall. And the NFC is going to be James Bradbury for the New York Giants, 94 overall. So, here we go. I'm going to get to the stats real quick. That's going to be relevant here. So, AJ Brown, 94. 93 speed. 91 jumping, 92 catching, just about low 90 catching across the board, low 90 route running across the board. Not going to be too great on this card, even with the 95. He'll get a 94 speed, but no power up, which is going to hurt him. Trent Williams is going to be our first guy over here as one of the team of the years. Now, guys, the James Bradbury, if we do go back real quick, though, you guys can see based off here. Uh, these were the stats on the screen right here. 94 speed. He's actually pretty good. 94 speed, 95 excel. Nothing crazy, but they're free players. Next, we got Trent Williams, left tackle for the 49ers, guys. Um, you know, really good pass blocking, really good run blocking. All around going to be a stud left tackle. Going to be probably the best left tackle in the game. Quentin Nelson, pretty self-explanatory. Good pass blocking, great run blocking. Going to be one of the best left guards in the game. We got Corey Lindsley, center, great run blocking. Probably the best lineman so far overall. And some of these guys will be able to be powered up. Some won't be. Brandon Scherf, right guard for Washington football team. Great all around, high run blocking, high pass blocking. Not spending too much time on the lineman, guys. I know this stuff's boring to you. Jack Conklin, high pass block, high run block, super good, guys. Uh, so the offensive line is going to be amazing. Russell Wilson is going to be our team of the year quarterback, which is one of my predictions. Russell Wilson, 88 speed, 94 throw power, 95 throw short, 95 throw medium, 95 throw deep, 93 throw under pressure, 95 throw on the run, and 94 play action. So he will get. 89 speed with 99 throw power with all 99 throwing accuracy besides deep if you go play fake on him gonna be a super great quarterback one of the best in the game may not be the best but one of the best dalvin cook just what we wanted guys dalvin cook another one on predictions he will get 94 speed 95 excel 96 agility 90 carrying 72 catching 96 change of direction 80 trucking and 96 break tackle now the speed and everything powered up he'll have a 95 speed 96 excel 97 agility uh gonna probably be worse than Aaron foster sadly 
so I don't think he will surpass him, but still fun. Darren Waller as the tight end, which is exciting because we were all scared of getting a Kelsey, but I guess they suspect they might be going to the bowl, so they saved him a card. But 92 speed, he's going to have 93 powered up, now 871 strength, going to get up to 99 catching just about, 95 catching traffic, 96 spec, and then mid-high 90 route running, which is great. And, you know, they've been giving everyone 70 run block all year, so kind of the norm. Stephon Diggs, another one of our predictions here. 94 speed, 90 jumping, 94 catching, 95 catch and traffic, 96 spec catch, 94 short, 94 medium, and 95 medium route running. Going to be great. Powered up and coming up, 95 speed, with going to get close to 99 route running, depending on which uh, play fake go deep you go. Great wide receiver. Justin Jefferson, which is exciting, because I did not know if they'd give it to him. I, don't know if, I thought a few guys like Devontae Adams deserved a little bit more, but Justin Jefferson had a great rookie year. That means they don't think he'll get rookie of the year. They probably think Herbert will get it, so they gave him this card. 94 speed, 93 jumping, 94 catching, 95 catch in traffic, 97 spec, 94 short, 95 medium, and 92 deep route running. Really good receiver. Can't get powered up, though, which is going to hurt him overall. Um, let's see what we got next. Joey Bosa, another one of our predictions. What matters here, guys, again, his block shot. Did he get it? Powered up and chemical, guys, he will get his block shot above a 90 if you put run stuff on him. But if you guys use pass rush, again, he will not get a 90 block shot, which will hurt this card. But otherwise, pretty good. Chris Jones, all year he hasn't been a good defensive tackle in the Madden. I don't know why they're making him bad. Way too slow. Great power move, good enough block shed, but not fast enough. But the card, the card's not bad if you got it for like free or something. Cameron Hayward, right end for the Steelers. What it matters here, way too slow to be used, but he will have 99 block shed or 99 power move or both, depending on what you guys use. So not bad. Demario Davis, another one of our predictions. 88 speed, way too slow already, and he's a linebacker. But he does get the block shed, and he does get some play wreck, maybe some zone, but speed too slow. Khalil Mack, 87 speed, 90 excel, 88 strength, 95 tackle, 96 play wreck, 94 block shed, 96 power move. So he will get 99 power move. His block shed will be high 90s, and his speed's pretty good as well. Levante David, middle linebackers. No one cares about them, but zone will get to 99. Hit power will be 96, and his speed will be 89. Not horrible, and good block shed. Bryce Callahan is going to be a slot cornerback. 95 speed, going to uh, get to 98 zone. 99 man, not bad actually. Okay, so we got the Xavier Howard from earlier. 94 speed, 96 zone, 96 press is what really matters here. He will get 95 speed and 96 excel with 99 zone. Will not get 99, uh, 99 man though, but still really good. Jesse Bates received for the Bengals, a little bit slower, 93 speed, no power up, but he will get 99 zone, but he will not get 99 man or 99 speed, oh, sorry, or 95 or above speed. So good, but not great. Jamal Adams. Now, this is the banger right here, guys. Power from Chem Dope. Jamal Adams will have a 95 speed with 96 Excel, with 99 zone, 99 man, and 98 hit power, and 99 play rate. This card is going to be the best safety in the game, probably. Do not sleep on Jamal Adams. Go scoop him up as soon as you can. This all releases tomorrow at about 10.30, probably, by the way. And player of the year, guys, the master set. The master set for the uh, whole team of the year promos. TJ Watt, 90 speed, 93 Excel, 85 strength, 96 tackle, 95 play rec, 94 block shit, 89 power move, and 96 finesse move. He's going to be good. He's going to have 91 speed, 94 excel, powered up and chemed up with 99 finesse move and good block shed. Going to be one of the best pass rushers in the game. And guys, the card art is super cool. Fred Warner from earlier again. Trey Hendrickson, a speed rusher. Uh, he's going to be like uh, one of those like rush ends. Not bad. Good speed. Good block shed. Good finesse move. Grady Jarrett, power rusher right here. So he's going to be a 95 block shed, 96 power move. Way too slow for defensive tackle. JD McKissick going to be a receiving back. 95 change of direction, 93 speed, 95 excel, 95 agility. Not great. Patrick Ricard, fullback for the Ravens, going to be our, all of our specialist players. This is actually our fullback. Uh, 96 run block, 97 lead block, 97 impact blocking. He's actually really good. If that speed can actually get you to the outside on, on lead blocks, he's going to be great. Gunnar Ozuski, Ol I forgot, I don't know how to say his name. Ozuski, 93 speed, 90 jumping, um, 94 short running. Good route running, good speed, uh, no power up. Jason Sanders is going to be our team of the year kicker. 96 kick power. Not bad. Jack Fox, kick power 97 for punter. Again, not bad. This card art's so cool, though. Not going to lie. Then, guys, we have our team of the year welcome pack. Again, a super cool pack. Like, they, they really went all out with the graphics this time. I really love it. Team of the year welcome pack. Nothing too good here. Let's see. Nat team of the year player. Play the team of the year challenge just to earn a Nat overall, a Nat 96 overall team of the year player. So, you do get one free 96 on top of the free uh, team of the year uh, team of the week solos all year that's two free and the pro bowl player khalil mack is the cover out right here exchange team of the year token that you earn team of the week to earn another 96 overall team of the year player so that's two here you go uh you get earned stars to receive the nat team of the year fantasy pack so the nat pack you're going to get is going to be one defensive one offensive one specialist pretty much you're going to hit in all three spots 
Well, I like this better actually because in years past they were like all different overalls. So if you got a pack full of 94s, you're pretty much lo you lost out in your whole pack. People got 97s. They're all 96s. So you're gonna get a banger regardless. It's gonna be an offensive, defensive, and specialist. You're gonna get a random one in each spot. And it's a fantasy. Pick one of the three. That's your right. That's your nap player. Here we go. We got some tiers. You get the pan fantasy pack at 100 stars. Not bad. Um, specialist, defense, and offense. Some solos. Some solos. Some solos. More solos. More solos, guys. Just re pause this if you guys feel the need to go through this one by one. Here you go. Team of the year. This is the set look and the Pro Bowl showdown. Super cool, guys. The graphics really went well this time. Defense, offense, specialist, team of the year exchange uh, with the sets. Here you go. Player of the year, TJ Watt. So you do turn in players of the week to earn 97 overall player of the year, TJ Watt. So it's going to be kind of like uh, positional heroes in the past, guys. You do exchange players to earn players, right? It's going to be players all year. So make sure you're getting that done. Here you go. So it'll be 95 overall as one then 89 to 93 and so on and so forth to create them you don't need team of the year players to create them which is pretty cool let's see what else we got guys we do have some of the sets here as you guys can see what they look like we got some more stuff here stefan Diggs, and here you go so for the team of the year players you can create them as well so that's going to be 92 95 92 to 95 92 95 random elites it seems like well random elites at positions right so it's gonna be like more like positional heroes than even the tj watts set was pretty cool so if you have any players in this overall range make sure you check your binder to see what they go for may have went up and the team of the year exchange token. This is your 14 team of the year tokens from the team of the week solo challenge. So make sure you're getting this done. This is your pack that I believe. I believe this one's auctionable. The other one was not. This one might be auctionable. Here's what it looks like. The team of the year tokens are super cool as well. And then here's the fantasy pack, guys. So right here will be your offensive hit, your defensive hit, and your specialist. So it could be, uh, this could be Dalvin Cook. This could be Xavier Howard. And this could be uh, Gunnar Lozinski, right? So it could be anyone. So you got to get lucky. Fun for pack opening. It's going to be fun for YouTube. I'll definitely get back to you guys on that. And yeah, guys, that's about it for the video. Hopefully, you guys did enjoy. If you have any questions, comment them down below. If you need more in-depth help, head on over to Twitter. The link will be down below in the description. DM me directly. If you guys need coins, which you're going to need to pick up some stuff tomorrow, head on over to Mutt Reserve and use code Poodle for 30% off, guys. Get hype. Comment down below who your favorite total team of the year player is so far that you can see. Uh, TJ Watt, obviously, for a lot of people. But who's the 96 that you really like? And yeah, that's about it, guys. Who are you going with the Pro Bowl? Who do you prefer? I'm leaning towards Bradbury. Probably most people are. But... Enough of that. Enjoy the rest of your day. Make sure to subscribe. Can we get 100 likes on this video, guys? Thank you for watching. I'm out. Peace.